Hi guys, this is Marius with the ERA. In today's video, we're going to show you how to upgrade the RAM in your computer and how to upgrade the hard drive in your computer. In this video, we're going to show you how to upgrade the RAM and the hard drive in this Asus G752V. As we can see here, this is a gaming laptop from the Republic of Gamer series of gaming laptops. It's a very nice machine with a very nice graphics card. Let's turn this on and press F2 to go into the BIOS. So here we have the BIOS and it looks like we have 16 GB of RAM. We don't know if there's one or two slots, but typically these machines will have two slots and some of them will have actually four. And as about the storage, let's go to the SATA configuration and it looks like there is a hard drive there. Toshiba, I'm assuming that that would be just a regular mechanical drive and we're going to replace that with a solid state drive. Disconnect from power. Alright, so we should remove this back cover. Use a flathead screwdriver. We're going to lift that rubber tab and there's a little screw there. So the 16 GB of RAM that we saw in the BIOS are actually placed under the keyboard on the other side of the motherboard we can actually see the sticker on one of the RAM chips we can actually add more we can add two more on this side for a total of 32 GB so we're going to add another 16 GB of RAM on this side for a total of 32 GB of RAM on this very nice gaming laptop. So just just insert, insert and press, press down, down until it, until clicks, it clicks and it and should, it should sit, there sit there properly. We see that we have room for a full size hard drive. However, I want to point out that this particular machine has this section here. Oh, it is now covered by this metal plate. And once we're going to remove that, you will see that we can actually install two M.2 SSDs in this section. It's a very nice machine with this extra space for storage. This machine is a real powerhouse. So we're gonna add an SSD on one of these slots, insert it into the socket like that, and secure it with this small screw. And now let's remove this hard drive and replace it with a solid state drive. So we're gonna install this 250 gigs Samsung SSD. There used to be a caddy here, we don't have it. So we're just gonna have to place this hard drive here, connect it, and then use this piece of foam. And then I'm just gonna have to put another piece of foam on top that'll hold this drive secure into place. We're gonna put back this metal plate after we test the system. Put the back panel on, don't screw it shut yet. We're gonna connect the power adapter, turn the laptop on, and then press F2 to go into the BIOS settings. It'll take just a little bit of time for the computer to register the new amount of memory. There you go. So now we have 32 GB of RAM, which will make this machine very fast and powerful. And now let's go to the SATA configuration under advanced. Here we see our 2.5 250 GB SSD upgrade, but not our M.2. Turns out our M.2 was defective. Yours should work fine. So the laptop is ready to go. We're just going to turn it off and screw everything back together. Basically, all we have to do is put back this metal plate, put back the bottom plastic cover, and tighten this screw. And that's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to give us a like and subscribe for more videos coming soon.